Hi, Hi we're John and Leah. Leah and today's video is what it says on the tin, things Americans say wrong. wrong. That is the most American intro we have ever done. Wrong. Lots of gestures. Yeah. Okay. So as usual, one of our favourite things on this channel is talking about articles we found online or blogs. Mm -hmm. Anything we found that we thought, that's interesting, let's discuss. Yeah. And this is a very personal blog of someone called Dimitri, who has made a list of things. These are my personal pet peeves regarding people's pronunciation of certain phrases here in the States. Fantastic. But before we start, this video <laughs> has been sponsored by Squarespace. Squarespace Squarespace is a platform where you can design your own websites, you can make a blog, you can promote your business, you can promote yourself. We're really good at self-promotion, as you guys know by now. You can do that with Squarespace, but we'll talk about them a little bit later on. So this blog, I mean, some things in this are very, very nitpicky. Yeah. I get the impression that Dimitri has been living in the US. Yeah. But before that was living in the UK. So, I mean... He's very triggered, very, guys. They're very specific, and this... this this person, I mean, I, I feel bad saying their name on the internet, but they've got their blog on the internet, so I'm yeah. pretty sure we're allowed to say this. Uh, this person's very nitpicky. Uh, and yeah, I don't agree with it. I feel like Americans don't say these things. I feel like he's got it wrong. I know. There's a lot of them that we will come across that Brits are guilty of as well. So let's yeah. just go through some of the list that we think is yeah. uh, pretty shocking. Okay, this one is ridiculous. It's so shocking. It must be wrong. Like So, the word boisterous. How do you guys say boisterous? Say it out loud. Three, two, one. Here's a girl saying it. Boisterous. Here's a boy saying it. Boisterous. Apparently, Americans say boisterous. boisterous. Like With voice. a B, boisterous. I'm shook. I don't even know if that's one. If that I've true. I've never heard an American say boisterous. Why would they replace the B with a V? I don't know. One thing that they do say wrong is could care less. Oh yeah. The phrase could care less. That triggers me so much. So many Brits that have been to America also agree on this. It's so annoying yeah. because the phrase is I couldn't care less. And that's the whole point. Like. Are you I, lit I literally couldn't care any less than I am caring right now. If you could care less, that means you're quite interested. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I do care. Yeah, I do care. Yeah. Like, it's so annoying yeah. and I don't know why Americans say it. It's couldn't care, care less. less. Like, someone insults you and you're like, I could care less. Oh, could you? Oh, so you, you do could, care You do care. I could care less. I care quite a bit. Let's start trying to get the word out there yeah. to any Americans that are watching. It's I couldn't care less. Just start dropping it in there with yeah. your family. See if anyone couldn't. picks up on it. And correct couldn't. people. I know you guys, some of you have messaged because you know this triggers us. Yeah. And we've said it in previous videos and you've been like, that's blown my mind. I can't believe I've been saying could care less. Now you explain it. It's so right. Yeah. And so please just spread the word. Let's we just want to make people speak correctly. Make America great again. Yeah. This is, that can't be real. They're saying Americans say drowned instead of drowned. drowned. So the past tense of drowned, so drowned. We'd say, oh, he drowned. Hopefully you wouldn't. Hopefully no one you know is drowned. <laughs> but they, apparently Americans say he's drowned. 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 Like an extra drowned. -ed. Drowned. I'm sorry. Americans don't the say that. The thing is, is that when I found out that Americans say burglarized, I... Anything's now possible. <laughs> Lost all faith. And like when they say addicting and instead addicting, of addictive. Addicting. Addicting. How is that game addicting? It's addictive. Yeah. Ah, oh, that one's weird. It's triggering, isn't it's it? It's triggering. And I think, think there's a lot of Brits that don't know this as well. That, yeah, that what these the words say it. like addictive. Yeah. Addicting, sorry. Addicting. Said it yeah. correctly. Oh, this other one. What? Espresso. Instead of oh, espresso, but okay. even Brits say espresso. Yeah, I've got, I've got to say, I've got friends that say, "Oh, I'm just gonna, just gonna get an espresso." When it is an espresso, yeah, Italians, yeah, you know, they're be triggered crazy. as well. Yeah. yeah, so it's not just Americans that get that wrong. Brits say yeah. that. I used to say espresso, I think. Oh well, yeah. So I didn't know when I was a kid. I was just like, "Oh, espresso." <laughs> when you were drinking coffee, yeah. you were a kid. And then I started drinking cortados or macchiatos. But oh yeah. Now Who invented I'm not all those all those fancy, fancy, fancy ones? Uh, Italians. Italians? Yeah. Macchiato. Oh sorry, this isn't actually this is related. Oh what is something that Americans say wrong that I really don't like. Go on. And not all Americans do it. Go on. But when instead of saying Italian, they'll say Italian. No yeah. way. They call them Italians. And I'm like... Italians? That sounds like the font Italian. I know. It's that Italian. That's shocking. And in the same way, they might say Iraq or Iran. And it's no. Iran or Iraq. 
something a Brit did that yeah. that bothered me. It's so nitpicky. I say Dubai. I say Dubai. Yeah. And they were like Dubai. I'm going to Dubai. Dubai. I'm going and to Dubai. Dubai. I got a flight to Dubai. Loads of people in my yeah. life have been saying it like that Dubai. recently. Dubai. What do you say? I, I say, say Dubai. 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 Same. Yeah. What do you say? On buy. What do you say? Say it back yeah. to me. Dubai. I say Dubai, not Dubai, Dubai not Italians or Iraq. It's just so true. Shocking. So Mina <laughs> is half Iranian and she gets so annoyed when Americans, like, if she, she always gets, like, I don't know if detain's the right word, but she always gets taken aside at American security because they don't trust any Iranians, stupidly. Okay. And they will always refer to her as Iranian or oh. something. And you're like, it makes it I'm not from Iran. <laughs> Firstly, I'm from the UK, okay. but secondly, it's Iran. It's yeah. not Iran. Iran. <laughs> oh, that's Iran. so annoying. It sounds like the word irate. Yeah. Like, oh, it's irate. irate. And yeah, yeah, it's like Iran. 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 <laughs> She's so not weird. from Iran. No, She's from Iran. Iran. <laughs> no, that's not true. No, I don't believe that. That, that is shocking. This is not true. Right, apparently the word height is said height. Height. You spelled height with an H on the end, so height. 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 The, sorry, the this height. person, Dimitri, height. like, he must have something against America because this is not true. We're we, sticking up for you guys. We need to get Dimitri on the channel because he's do. also said that they say horseradish as horseradish. Horseradish. <laughs> horseradish. This is fantastic. Horseradish. I mean, I know certain occasions where do, Americans do insert a yeah. shh noise, but I okay. can't think of an example, but I've never heard them say horseradish. 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 No, I've never, but I've never heard an American order horseradish. No, <laughs> no, say <saying> horseradish. <laughs> horseradish. Okay, here's one for discussion. Everyone's got a different way of saying chipotle. Yeah. I say chipotle. Yeah. What do you say? Chipotle. Would you? <laughs> well, you guys know I like saying words wrong. I Chipotle. love saying jalapeno. I yes. love saying chipotle. Chipotle. Um, so but yeah, I'd say, say chipotle like bottle. Yeah. Chipotle. But I probably would say chipotle. Okay. Um, but then some people say chipotle, don't they? Yeah. Or chipotle. Chipotle. Chipotle or chil ch ch chipotle. I don't know. No, he's what? just. There's so many ways to pronounce chipotle. Yeah. Um. Just go for the like complete wrong pronunciation of things. It's more fun. It triggers people. Chipotle. Everyone tries. I just love watching someone's face when they're scooping jalapenos. When yeah. they're like, "Do you want? Do you want some of these?" And I, or "What do you want?" And I'm like, "Ah, oh, jalapenos." I just love you, seeing that flicker in their eyes of like. He's saying it why wrong. Why is he saying jalapenos? That's amazing. I just love it. You just love. What could I start saying um, instead of bowl? I could say bowl. Bowl. One bowl. Would bowl. you like a wrap or a bowl? Yeah, bowl, bowl. Or, or what's Just a, anything? What I say guacamole. Yeah, and that triggered. I've been I've been I told off on this channel though. for the word guacamole. When it's even what Americans get triggered with when we say tacos though, because Americans tacos. will say tacos. Yes, but we say tacos. tacos. See, I I no one in the UK has ever said taco. Taco. No, it's I, normally Americans moaning at Brits for inserting an R into a word oh. but they do that with taco tacos. yeah when we say tacos you say taco tacos tacos we're just two tacos yeah, yeah just two, two, two tacos, tacos out here trying to make a living on youtube having a chinwag so if you're liking this so far subscribe to our channel give us a comment leave a nice comment or a nasty yeah. one you might appear in our other series reading yeah. out hate mail yeah you might or you might just go straight into our spam folder and we won't ever see it so <laughs> <laughs> so apparently instead of supposedly americans say supposedly with a b and i feel like i've heard it before i feel like i have as well supposedly uh, yeah supposedly so supposedly instead of supposedly yeah i've definitely heard that one yeah. before i have Nice one, Dimitri. Yeah, you Hats got off that to you. Right. you. Did you did get that Correct. one right? Correct. But do you know what? I can't. Probably. I can't talk really because I I say probably. What? Like probably instead of probably. Probably. I drop the a extra a b. I'm like probably. You'll probably get that. Yeah, you'll, you'll probably, probably prob get. Prob you'll prob probably get that. Probably. Yeah, loads of us do that. Yeah, don't we? we just drop the extra probably. Yeah, it's just the ease yeah. of that. I was asking Joel earlier. Why is it that lots of Londoners say arcs? Yeah. Don't ask me that question instead of ask. And apparently it's linguistically easier. Yeah. And it's not for your easier mouth. to go from K to S so K than it's it is to go from S to K. -sk. So some, yeah, Londoners will say ask instead London. of ask. Yeah. Are you asking me? Are you asking me a question? <laughs> Come on, Jane. I just turned into Miranda. <laughs> Miranda <the> sings. <laughs> right, there's a few more on this article. I mean, it's 
fascinating, yeah. honestly. Yeah, like take for granted instead of take for granted. <laughs> Do you really say take that? Take for granted. Take, take for granted. Really? What about vice versa? Oh, I don't like that. It's vice, vice versa. versa. Not vice, vice versa. versa. Vice versa. Yeah. And there was one more. It was at the very top. I, I did hear Americans say it quite a bit and it, it does trigger me. Oh, yeah. um, this adaptation is based on a Shakespeare novel. Yeah. Not based off of. I yeah. feel like you hear the off of. Uh, off like, of, yeah. I hear that a lot in American things. Uh, off of. Yeah, that's true. I don't know which is correct. I don't... I really don't know if it's grammatically incorrect to say that. I'm exactly. trying to think of why it might not be grammatically just, correct, but I can't think of anything. Just sounds so good but in just, American yeah. accent, doesn't it? Based off of. Yeah. Based off of. It's based, based off, off of. Just of. Yeah, not based not on. Based on. Based on. Based off of. Based on yeah, a true Yeah, because you base something on, on something. something. This you don't is the base, base something off of, of something. You bounce Maybe off. We say like, oh, yeah. you bounce off of, I bounced off of his idea. Yeah. We bounce off of each other. Yeah bounce off each other. We say we bounce off each other. Yeah. Maybe in American say you bounce off of each other. Off, like off, off each I feel other. like there's an extra off. off, off I've heard it Yeah, so we bounce much. off each other, not bounce, bounce off, off of each other. other. That's so true. Maybe it's the extra off. I've heard it in loads of things. Yeah. But it's like when Americans say that we get it wrong because we'll say, oh, I'm going to hospital. And yeah. they're like, why have you missed out that? But it's like, it's just like the same way that you say, I'm, I'm going, going to school. Yeah. yeah, but, uh, yeah, but yeah, I guess. School. But I'm going to school. Americans will say I'm going to school. You don't say I'm going to the, the school. school. It's the yeah. same thing. I'm going to sc I'm going to hospital. I'm not going to the hospital. hospital. I mean, you can say that, but yeah. Brits would most likely just say I'm going to hospital. I think we'd only ever use the article the the if it was a specific like I'm yeah. going to the the, the school hospital. like the hospital, which is this specific yeah. hospital. Whereas we just say I'm going to hospital. Yeah, but it yeah. triggers them so much because they're like, why are you skipping letters? Oh, that's interesting. Well, we're here to celebrate it all, yeah. aren't we? We're not here to sort of nitpick. This article no. is very nitpicky. And we so just nitpicky. found it very entertaining that we wanted to talk about it. I mean, we 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 let you guys, we let you guys, <laughs> we let you say whatever you want. I don't care what anyone says. As long as yeah. they don't say I could care less. <laughs> then you're fine. Then it's fine. Like, honestly, that's the only thing I get triggered by. Yeah. Other than that, people should be able to speak the way they want. Yeah. I know how awful is having studied linguistics yes. when people yeah. will be like you said this wrong this is grammatically incorrect and you studied linguistics I'm like I don't care I yeah. don't care like I don't, I don't care. it doesn't just because I study linguistics I don't, I don't yeah know. I, I think, know what you're saying basically it's like people that say on the internet oh I, I, I'm really into sustainability and then get, they get caught one time using something yeah. that's like plastic and then the internet hounds them I know it's because you've put some information out people will try and attack and attack and attack but any true linguist will let you speak yeah. the, that I won't go into it, yeah. but we were taught at <laughs> university, <laughs> well, we were taught at university that people who have a rigid set of rules going, this is the dictionary, this is correct, are wrong. So people uh, who are taught linguistics are taught to like celebrate that everyone sounds different, everyone yeah. like, when there's new words that enter the dictionary, instead of going, oh great, it's another Americanism in the dictionary. It's exciting, a new yeah. word has entered, lit. Yeah. The word lit. It's lit. Lots of old people, especially old Brits, will be like, oh great, another Americanism. Yes. But we're like, this is amazing, it's another word. Yeah, so true linguists are taught to celebrate yeah. the differences, which is what we feel we are doing on this channel and on this, yeah. you know, on this video. Except for Cook Less. Except for Cook Care Less, which is really triggering. Um, but yeah, we don't get truly, truly triggered by anything no. apart from Cook Care Less. Yeah. So we hope you can appreciate that and not be triggered um, moving forward. Yeah. We hope you are subscribed to our channel yeah, for subscribe. more. Yeah, subscribe. We post videos every single week, twice Plus weekly, weekly, sometimes more. more. <laughs> um, and if you want to start your own blog in addition to Dimitri's blog, <laughs> maybe to correct him then don't forget you can use Squarespace yeah. they've got great tools for bloggers especially and even if you're not a blogger but yeah. if you are a blogger you can use their tools to schedule posts and things like that and you can just get back at Dimitri and be like hey Dimitri my you're blog's wrong. better than yours yeah <laughs> no offense Dimitri but are I you using Squarespace use Squarespace yeah. to make this a lot more visually interesting <laughs> just a, just an idea just saying poor Dimitri if he ever finds this video what if he's a oh, viewer oh gosh Dimitri Sorry. I'm so sorry. Sorry, Dimitri. Love you. Love you. 
have a go at the free trial it's so mm -hmm. worth it and if you want to go ahead be sure to use our discount code which is in the link in our description yeah thank you so much we will see you soon see you soon guys bye i mean americans can speak any way they want they've invented yeah. some good words oh yeah they really have yeah where you at i love that we'd say where are you but america's like where, where are you where? at where you at? Where you at? It sounds cool. Yeah, absolutely. Can we start picking up the phone saying where you at? Yeah, where you at? I'd be like, that's rude. Hey, yeah. <laughs>